Um, a science fiction author named Pat Cadigan, in a story called Death in the Promised Land, once suggested that the internet waking up was rather akin to the ancient suggestion that you could put dirty shirts and straw in a box and get the spontaneous generation of mice. I essentially buy that. I, I, I mean, intelligence is not emergent any more than, you know, the complex order inside an ant colony is emergent. The brain has been shaped by millions upon millions of generations of natural selection, you know, not just random changes, but we're going to, you know, random changes and keep the good ones over and over and over again. The, the system as a whole is not this diffuse mass of neurons that, you know, just sort of wire up and uh, poof, start thinking. You, you can't just, you know, like scale up a lizard brain and get a human brain. It doesn't work that way. You've got all these different complicated areas doing different complicated things. And, you know, if, if you're going to have an intelligence, then it's not going to be something that poofs out of the traffic control system because the traffic lights are talking to each other. And, you know, oh my goodness, it's intelligence. We had no idea the systems could do that. I mean, maybe if you had a computer the size of the entire universe, something like that might happen by accident inside it, but even then it would be some kind of accident that involves something akin to natural selection getting started. Intelligence is heavily optimized. Something has to be optimizing it, whether that's natural selection or a human programmer, before it can, you know, pop up. Now, Google does have people who are deliberately working on AI. They're actually trying to create AI. It's not that, you know, you're going to have poof, stuff comes out of the cloud, but that, you know, people were actually trying to do it and then they succeeded. So that's a possibility. But this sort of thing happening spontaneously because, oh, we got so many computers networked together, um, I'll actually sort of put my foot down in here and say, WRONG!